Hello everyone, welcome back. So in the last uh, session we did uh, ASK in lab view. So I told you that there are some minor changes what you have to do in for to convert ASK into PSK and FSK. So just a very brief review like how do you proceed with your project. So just open your lab view then select since you are creating a new project you could select blank 6. Uh, I will be editing the same program or uh, just uh, I, I can do a brief uh, okay leave it so let's open ASK and uh, press Control T to have that other window project window block diagram window so this is what we did in the last experiment so you could just go and view the previous window if you have not seen that one so that's the base base of it we will be just making small some small changes to it to get our FSK and PSK. So right now I'm doing I'm going to do P phase shift king PSK. So the only one thing what you need to do is take two make it minus one. Okay, minus one. And that's it. Okay, what's happening here? I'll delete it. Create another one. Right click. Right click create constant minus one so this is it you're done with it and um, if I just run this see you could see that every at every one whenever the in input value is one there's your this complete uh, normal wave then when there's a zero there's a 180 degree phase shift and you get a 180 degree phase shift like afterwards the same wave till the next point when there's a one Again, there is 180 degree phase shift and that, that is what uh, PSK is, phase shift king. Every time you see a change in your bit, you do 180 degree phase shift. That's what we wanted. So one more thing I forgot to tell you in the last one. Uh, I forgot to tell you what's the use of this array. So you will observe this. First go to your data operations, clear chart. Here also data operations, clear chart. Once you have cleared this one, now when you run it once you see that everything is zero zero is uh, uh, generated by this random block then there is zero next run okay I did a, another run okay now you see one is coming on your array part huh look at this one one zero one 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 zero one one this is what so no there is some issue one zero one one this is one zero one one this is the part what this array is showing so the how many times I run it it shifts or there is a new number generation so this bit corresponds this part of my chart corresponds to whatever array is showing one zero one 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 zero one one so if you run it multiple times or if you do do you do a continuous run and then stop it this won't make any sense because there's a matchup of like which part of the graph it's showing you don't know right now maybe it's this part only 0 0 0 all this corresponding part which which I showed you so that's what array is uh, that's what uh, we have placed array for seeing that thing so PSK was this easy so uh, for if we like to go for uh, FSK what you need to do is I don't wanna like uh, make another video for that one you could just see the same video you delete this line from here and you remove this constant now what you need to do is take your frequency this time since it's FSK frequency shift king now your frequency is a function of whatever selections your select block makes so right now it's frequency here selected be careful don't select amplitude it's frequency this is the difference in FSK otherwise uh, most of the thing is same then uh, you choose uh, here what you do is make it 4 and make it 2 so this is uh, like instead of 2 make it 1 you will you will see the difference clearly so if I run this now see 
wherever there is one there is high frequency wave there is zero there is low frequency wave that is like one times of it this is one if it's um, one cycle in just one seconds then this time there are four cycles in one seconds because it's four times the frequency of your other wave you could do do it the other way you could change the numbers it would be just swapping of zero and one bits or if i just make it two you could see there is two where two cycles in just one wave for zero and four cycles for one wave in where, wherever there is one so you can adjust this accordingly and this one i think four and one uh, gives a more clear picture of it so this is very simple modification what you need to do to get fsk frequency shift gain so the main thing you what you need to remember is whatever your shift block outputs this only runs your or generates the signal this is only responsible for generating what type of signal so this time in fsk your frequency is a function of your output of select device and if it's true if it's there's a one from this side it outputs four so there is four times like four times of the cycle of no one there are four cycles in one second and if it's false if it gives if this thing gives zero this will be one and there will be just one cycle in one second so that's it in in psk as well as ask it's amplitude and in fsk it's frequency you don't um, need to change much so this is it if you have any doubts you can just mention it in the comments and even i will attach a link to all these files i will save these files and uh, upload it in the drive and you can download it from there